Actress Demi Moore is letting her guard down in her new memoir, Inside Out. She talks about really everything. Her first husband, Bruce Willis, her second husband, her ex-actor, Ashton Kutcher. She talks about having a miscarriage, also cheating. In her interview with the New York Times as well, spilling a lot more that's worth reading. Joining me now is pop culture expert John Murray. John, I'm a huge fan of Demi Moore, and she holds nothing back, talking about her struggles, and her daughters are even saying, look, we're proud of our mom for doing this. Absolutely, Susan. Demi Moore's memoir sounds like it's going to be more explosive than the recurring role she had on Empire last season because she's letting it all hang out. As you mentioned, she has the revelation that her 15 years younger second husband, Ashton Kutcher, he did cheat on her. And early on in their relationship, she was pregnant and she miscarried after about six months. But once she realized that that relationship was over, her career had hit a low, she turned to alcohol and Vicodin. And she had that episode where she collapsed while out partying with her daughter, Rumor Willis started convulsing and ultimately checked herself into rehab. But she's turned the corner. She realized she spiraled out of control. She did the self-work. And one of Hollywood's most notorious cougars, she's letting it all hang out and inside <laughs> out, which will be out in just a few weeks on bookshelves. Did you have to go in there with the cougar? We, you were on a straight line. We love line. a good cougar, Susan. You were on we a love straight a good line. Cougar. You were going, you were going, and then all of a sudden. <laughs> Let's talk Kim K, shall we? Yes. She's getting a lot of pushback, but I think Kim is the type of person, I don't know her personally, I feel like I do, who is the underdog and used to working that way. She says, look, I'm not at Fashion Week, and here's why. I'm studying. Here she is. I wanted to go to law school because I feel like the more that I know, the more I can really do and change. And I love having an attorney with me every step of the way. Mm -hmm. um, You're going to law school? I am. Did you graduate I college? Am. Um, no, I did not. So how do you get Thank you. Yeah. Good for you. That was Kim Kardashian on The View, John, and she's not going to law school. So how does this work? Because I know in a few states you don't have to, but it certainly isn't easy, right? I mean, she has to have a mentor, a lot of studying, saying, look, I have to do this myself, and I am doing it myself, John. Absolutely, Susan. This, the program and the path that she's on is probably the most extensive apprenticeship program we've ever heard. And here's the thing. I watched Kim's appearance on The View, and I was very impressed. And just like co-host Sonny Hostin, who apologized to Kim, I, too, have changed my position on Kim taking a non-traditional path to adding Esquire to the end of her name. And here's why. Kim mm -hmm. really wants to positively affect uh, criminal justice reform. And we know she's already been working with Van Jones and this administration to do that. She also wants to use her platform platform to work against the injustices that black and brown people face in our legal system. So all of that's a positive thing. I can also understand why Kim is getting some pushback, because this is a non-traditional means to becoming a lawyer. And we're used to the reverse, Susan. We're mm -hmm. used to celebrities uh, who were lawyers. So like folks like Star Jones, who used to co-host The View, uh, WWE star David Otunga, uh, talk show veteran mm -hmm. Jerry Springer, they were all lawyers who became stars. We're not used to celebrities working to become lawyers. But listen, you can roll this tape back in five years. I'm saying it now. The mm -hmm. minute Kim passes the bar in 2024, Chris Jenner will be producing Kim K's <laughs> court. So all rise. <laughs> Judge Judy, you're about to have some competition. There's going to be a gavel, too, with Kim K's name on it. She's working with Van Jones as well. John Murray, always good to see you. You crack me up. Enjoy yes, your you weekend, do. Susan. You too.